Mixed Connective Tissue Disease, Wikipedia Article Audio Mixed Connective Tissue Disease, commonly abbreviated as MCTD, is an autoimmune disease characterized by the presence of high blood levels of a specific autoantibody, now called anti-U1 ribonucleoprotein. The idea behind the mixed disease is that this specific autoantibody is also present in other autoimmune diseases such as systemic lupus erythematosus, polymyositis, scleroderma, etc. It was characterized in 1972, and the term was introduced by Leroy in 1980. Signs and Symptoms Causes Diagnosis Treatment Prognosis It is sometimes said to be the same as undifferentiated connective tissue disease, but other experts specifically reject this idea because undifferentiated connective tissue disease is not necessarily associated with serum antibodies directed against the U1 RNP and MCTD is associated with a more clearly defined set of signs-slash-symptoms. MCTD combines features of scleroderma, myositis, systemic lupus erythematosus, and rheumatoid arthritis and is thus considered an overlap syndrome. MCTD commonly causes It has been associated with HLA-DR4. Distinguishing laboratory characteristics are a positive, speckled antinuclear antibody and an anti-U1 RNP antibody. The prognosis of mixed connective tissue disease is in one-third of cases worse than that of systemic lupus erythematosus. In spite of prednisone treatment, this disease is progressive and may in many cases evolve into a progressive systemic sclerosis also referred to as diffuse cutaneous systemic scleroderma which has a poor outcome. In some cases though the disease is mild and may only need aspirin as a treatment and may go into remission where no anti-U1 RNP antibodies are detected, but that is rare or within 30% of cases. Most deaths from MCTD are due to heart failure caused by pulmonary arterial hypertension. Joint pain slash swelling, malaise, Raynaud phenomenon, muscle inflammation, and, sclerodactyly.